We are here with men's swimming and diving junior captain, Derek Toomey. Derek, how does it feel to be the leader of this gopher team? You know, it, it's really exciting. You know, coming here as a freshman, I instantly fell in love with the team. And I, I loved every kid on the team, every guy on the team, all the women on the team. And it, it means a lot to me to be nominated to lead these guys this year, hopefully to a much better season. And uh, to motivate the guys, you know, I, I'm always big into pushing guys to the next level. So I'm, I'm, I feel real honored to have this position on the team. This team has a talented group of freshmen. Are you excited to help them and watch them grow? I sure am. I, I, I just remember my freshman year, the seniors and juniors on the team and how much they pushed me and helped me to get to the Big Ten and NCAA level my freshman year. And I, I have big hopes of myself and the other seniors on the team to do the same. I know uh, a couple guys I think are going to be outstanding is another sprinter, Ryan Mitch. I'm real excited to kind of help him along this year, hopefully get him on some of the sprint relays. And then uh, Ben Brayman's kind of a mid-sprint, mid-distance kind of guy for us. I'm, I'm excited to see how those two boys do, along with many of the other freshmen. I'm, I'm really excited for all of them. Uh, what meets are you looking forward to this season? You know, every year we host a Grand Prix meet uh, in November, and I'm, I'm really excited to that because Michigan comes to that meet, and we get to race them on that. And uh, other ones, any Big Ten rivalry we have. So when we race against Wisconsin, when we race against Iowa, and we, when we race against Wisconsin and Purdue in a triple dual meet, um, I'm also looking forward to swimming against USC while we're in Hawaii this year, which is new, and I uh, get to race some of the best sprinters in the, in the country. So I'm, I'm looking forward to all those. And then, of course, got got to say Big Tens and NCAAs. I mean, I live for those two championship meets, so does everyone else on the team. I think it's going to be an awesome year, and I think we're going to turn some heads this year at those two meets. Who else do you think will play a big role in the success of the team this year? You know, no one person is – you're, you're as, a, you're te as a team, you're as successful as your weakest guy, I feel like. And there's no one on the team who doesn't contribute to the team's success. So as we will have you know, big point scorers such as Kyler Van Swall, uh, Big Butterflyer, uh, CJ, who a big distance freestyler, along with many other guys, very key relay swimmers. But I think every guy, uh, even the non-point scorers in practice, you know, helping motivate us, helping pushing us, uh, you know, they all contribute to the team's success as a whole. So it's a tough question to answer. I think everybody kind of contributes to the, the whole team. What are a few strengths of this year's team? Uh, of course, we have a lot of really good returning guys, uh, NCAA qualifiers from last year, which we'll be swimming this year. But I think our biggest um, key to point scoring is probably our freshmen. I think, uh, you know, every year you can look back at, seniors, juniors, and sophomores year times from last year. You can get a sense of what they might go this year, but the wild card is always the freshmen, and I think our wild cards are looking pretty good. I think we're going to score a lot of points with our freshmen, <clears throat> get ahead of some of the other teams that aren't quite expecting it. With the women hosting the Big Ten Championships, how big of a role does that play for the men's team? You know, being at any big meet gets people pumped up. I know, for example, we had a couple guys at the Olympic Trials, and Coming off of that meet, everyone was excited and motivated to get better. And I think having women's Big Tens a week before our Big Tens at our home pool, we'll be there, we'll be cheering for the women, and watching them succeed and swimming well is only going to motivate us to get that much better for next weekend at our Big Ten meet. So I think it'll, be, I think it'll help our team out a lot to host that meet. How was your experience at the Olympic Trials this summer? It was really good. Uh, we had about nine guys, I think, and also about nine or ten girls make it. And everybody swam really well. It was a really cool experience being right up there with the top tier swimmers in the world. But, uh, you know, I ended up personally about 30th overall, which was good. Had best times, so I can't complain with that. A uh, teammate of mine, Kyler Van Swall, uh, finished ninth place in his butterfly race, which was awesome. But uh, both me and Kyler had a very good meet at the end of the summer at the U.S. Open, where we both qualified for the World University Games in Russia next summer. So we'll both be heading to that, and we're really excited for that.